একুশে ফেব্রুয়ারি আমি কি ভুলিতে পারি ছেলে হারা শত মায়ের অস্ত্র গড়ায় ফেব্রুয়ারি আমি কি ভুলিতে পারি Assalamu alaikum everyone, Zarin Tasim Priyam here again before you and today as you heard this song, I was singing this because February is a month of language, February is a month of mother tongue. Because on the 21st of February 1952, many Bengalis they sacrificed their life for mother tongue Bangla and in 1999, the 17th of November, UNESCO declared 21st February as International Mother Language Day. So as I was feeling my mother tongue, as I am really proud to be a Bengali, I was singing this song before you. So, you know, many people, many Bengalis were martyred on the protest of 21st February. We knew on only five of their names. So they were Salam, Rufiq, Barko, Jabbar and Shofir. Today I'm going to discuss about only one of them, the first martyr of 21st February, who was Rafiq Uddin Ahmed. So let's not make any delay and move on to our main discussion. Rafiq Uddin Ahmed was born on 1926 and literally he died on 1952. So he was the eldest son of his family and he completed his masters and his metric in a very good way but when he was admitted to Jagannath University when he came to Dhaka for helping his father in the printing press then at that time Khaza Nazimuddin the prime minister of the then Pakistan the then West Pakistan he declared that Urdu shall be the only state language of Pakistan and then 144 sections were raised by the Pakistanis, the West Pakistanis, those who were the leaders and it was saying that if any person goes out of their house or makes any protest in the road on the 21st of February, then that person will be killed brutally. But that declaration was not acceptable by the Bengalis, especially Rafiq Uddin Ahmed, because they knew that Bangla was their mother tongue and it was a hard tongue for them. It was a hard language for them. So they did not accept the protest and they did not accept the 144 sections. So on the 21st of February, they went on the roads and they started protesting saying Rashtrabhasha Bangla Chai. This means that I want Bengali to be a state language besides Urdu. They didn't say that only Bengali shall be the state language but they said that Urdu as well as Bengali shall be the state language. So police started firing on the Bengalis and they started brutally killing people. Rafiquddin Ahmed was shot on the head and his dead body was found on the roof room 5 of the anatomy hall of Dhaka Medical College. He was buried in Azimpur graveyard but after few years his grave could not be found. But still that language martyr is really remembered in our heart. We will always remember him because of him because of other martyred intellectuals in that day. We are now being able to talk in Bengali. We are now being able to celebrate 21st February as the International Mother Language Day. So thank you so much Rafiq Uddin Ahmed. I salute you for doing such a great protest for protecting our language Bangla. I am saluting you again because you did such a great job that no one who does not have any braveness could not. So thank you so much everyone for watching this video. Inshallah I'll come up with another interesting video next time. Till then keep your eyes on my videos. Bye bye. आपना शानदार आपना कल से एक टी शॉप नो एक टी प्रोजेक्ट मो एक टी बांग्लादेश है देश भर के प्रत्येक प्रतिष्ठित हुए थे बॉस बांग्लादेश ऑनलाइन स्कूल वो शेप फ्यूचर फॉर एडमिशन प्लीज कॉल और एसएमएस टू जीरो वन सिक्स टू जीरो 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 फोर टू डबल जीरो